Hey, this is Darren LaCroix, sitting in my office in lovely Las Vegas, Nevada. And it's what I do here that determines if I get up on stage. What you do off stage determines if you get on stage. So time is so crucial. Whether you're an existing speaker out there killing it, or you're an emerging speaker who's trying to figure out your way, your time is such a, a precious asset. So it's what you do with it, and it's the direction you get as to strategies, tactics, ideas, marketing. It's what you do with that time that's so important. For example, when I brought in Regina, who runs my office and has been for three years, on the very first day of her job, I sat her across this desk, and I said, here's Darren's best use of time. Number one, me being on stage. Literally being up there, whether it's for a high paid fee or whether it's for free, building my list or marketing my university or getting people to know about me. That's how I'm most influential. So that's my number one use of time. Number two is me creating content. Whether it's a video like this to help teach and draw people to want more, or whether I'm writing an article for my blog or my weekly newsletter stage time. That's my second best use of time. My third best use of time is me creating product. Putting together that important information to help people solve a problem or get an aspiration that they desire. So for example, if we were going to, uh, you wanted to know YouTube and understand YouTube, you and I might sit down and have lunch and I might explain it to you and show you some things on a whiteboard and that's not a very efficient use of my time. However, so, well, let, let's say if I wanted to help 20 people, I would have to do 20 lunches. However, if I duplicated, if I took that same information and put it in a duplicatable format, whether it's MP3s, online program, uh, DVDs, and now I can duplicate it or multiply it, mass multiply my energy and effort. So even though maybe it takes me two or three hours, now it's being duplicated multiple times. So that's my third best use of time, creating programs or products that can be sold. And I leaned in and I said, your job is to keep me doing those three things as much as possible. So if you're an emerging speaker, when you're doing things off stage, just understand you've got to prioritize because there's only so much time in the day. And if you still have a day job, well, now you have to even be more careful, but understand that your check is a double bonus because it allows you to do the other things and pay for invest in a website or something else that you need. So that being said, what are you doing with your time? Block it out. And one great use of time is to get educated in what's changing in the industry. So I encourage you to come join Ford Sakes and me in November for Get Paid to Speak 2. Two days that's going to take you from where you are to where you want to go and know exactly what you need to work on. So join us for that event.